gang. Well, but I still wanna party. Pink feel like I'm ready to bend. I'm a ten, so I pull in a can. But know that we love you. Happy birthday. When it came to the end, when it came to the cardio, I was supposed to do five reps of two cardios back then. And I only did two. So technically I didn't even finish the cardio. I mean finish the damn workout. But y'all, well technically it didn't take me three hours because I say like a good hour of it, we was recording content. So but not for the blog, just content. So, two hours, I would say, it took me to finish that damn workout. Y'all, I am tired. But overall, I'm grateful, though. I'm really trying to lock in and create a schedule for your kindred because I really need to get my behind back in that gym because I just have not been feeling my best physically. You know, I've been feeling very tired and just, like, sluggish and just, like, not good and i'm also the heaviest that i've ever been i mean i'm also the oldest that i've ever been too so i mean i'm 141 pounds but you have to realize i'm only 5'1 you know what i'm saying so like this right here i don't like that i don't like
like that. And when I lay down, I be like mad uncomfortable. That's how I know I'm just like not supposed to be this size. Like some people are just small frame and I'm supposed to be small frame. Like I feel my best when I'm between the weight of like 125 and 130. Like anything over that, especially 10 pounds over that, kind of push. But yeah, so I'm trying to really like get back in the gym and me having a trainer is definitely gonna have your girl motivated and dedicated so i'm grateful that george is um willing to train with your kendrick because hello what ciao so now that his um schedule is a little bit more flexible these days um uh, we're going to be training together so we either if we don't train tomorrow i'm still going to get up behind in the gym and he's going to tell me what to do but we should be meeting back up again on friday but um yeah, literally as soon as I got done working out, I came upstairs and I crashed on my couch. I was so exhausted. And then when I got up, I got up originally to go get my camera so I could vlog. Y'all, when I got up off this couch, my my legs felt so weak, I almost fell to the ground. I was like, oh my God. So I had to sit back down and just kind of like chill out. And then I just went ahead and like showered and stuff. I'm so hungry. And that's another thing too. I didn't really eat today. So I'm starving. Like my body is shaking right now. And I've been trying to wait until Brandon comes. Brandon's coming into that town today. His flight landed at what, seven o'clock? It's currently 10. And he's just now on the way. Cause he decided to get a rental. So then we're just gonna go grab some food. I We were originally gonna go to a restaurant right across the street, but everything in this bucket area closed for the most part at 10 o'clock and it's 10 o'clock but i did find another restaurant actually the restaurant that i went to for my birthday they closed today at 12. so i'm hoping that we can make the kitchen because their food is good it's a mediterranean spot and i know their food is going to be fulfilling and kendra ain't eat all day i'm starving i'm shaking so yeah y'all get to see brandon a lot of my kids been asking about brandon so you guys got your wish brandon is in town today and he'll be here for a couple of days back into town it's been like over a year and we're about to go to a soccer game here in Atlanta Georgia what is it the Mercedes-Benz Stadium I've actually never been to the stadium the whole two years that I've been here so this should be fun and exciting how you feeling I feel good I'm excited we're gonna have some fun what was it's that? the first time for me too what was that Oh, peace, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, so I had some fun. I ain't never been there either, so it should be a good day. You know what I need? I need a nice little, nice little, nice little shot to take me, take me off the edge. Take the edge off? Yeah, they take the edge off. Don't, don't, don't get taken off the edge. <laughs> don't do that. It's my bad side, Brandon. Mm -hmm. It's my bad side. It's your bad side? Yeah. What the street over here? I, I know. <laughs> I said, it got to be your bad side today. I know. Oh, this is right now. Mercedes Benz Stadium. Never been. It's like four miles. 
I'm not a music person, please. Oh my god. Man. It's like the same. Man. You letting eyes down for real. I'm just. This camera about to fall. Oh, wait, just. See, you breaking it. I do that on purpose. Don't do that. Just chill. <laughs> Drive smooth. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what that movie we watched earlier? That's so why I did it the first time. I'm gonna just put the damn. Because it's gonna happen. Nah, bitch is gonna do this. Yeah. Got your nose. Yeah. 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 Yeah
So when you're feeling lazy, you don't really feel like doing too much. So you know we had to get sick. I don't know if y'all ever seen this before. I ain't never seen that before either. This is, it look crazy, but. We might have to. Yeah, we might have to bust this open. So that might be dessert. <laughs> 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 we gotta bust this open. So. <laughs> raisin, crunch, raisin bread crunch. That's for my normal breakfast. But I don't feel like making no nothing special. Which one's your favorite cereal? Is it this? Yes. For sure. I'm about to say, this is definitely a. Uh, it might have to be second to the uh, cinnamon toast crunch. Cinnamon toast crunch is good. It might be second to that. That's, I don't know about that. That's, 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 that's something else. Cinnamon toast crunch have your, 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 your mouth smelling a little something. Like Cheerios. You know how Cheerios make your stuff smell a little Cheerio ish? A little tall, y'all can't see my face expression right now, but <laughs> I don't know about it. Stop. She got some more of this damn organic jalapeno lime. I, I never had it to, to talk my shit. It just don't sound that good. She said it's good, but it's so good. There you go, honey smacks. That shit have your piss smelling like <laughs> this is the honey smack. First of all, who eats that? This is good. Who eats that? I do. I did when I was little. When you was little? Honey Smacks is good. I ain't seen no sense. This is shit that make me. This That's is the shit that my grandmother used to give me. We get old. Yeah, yeah. I ain't had this shit in a long time. Yeah. I don't care. I know a lot of y'all don't like raisins and oatmeal. That's how shit. old we is. But oatmeal, oatmeal raisin cookies is amazing. That's how old you are. Twenty-one. Jamaican dude. I is. I show sure is. People, when people look at me, they be like, "Oh my god, I didn't know that she was twenty-eight. Make sure like, y'all yeah. double check the blog. I'm twenty-one. Double I'm check. Still young, tender, fresh, tender, wrong day. Go back and rewatch some no of them blogs. The I double check. Move. To make fact fresh. check her on twenty-one, please. I'm young, tender. Jamaican beef patties. Need those. She really likes this flatbread pizza. Mushrooms. Add a little bit of buffalo sauce on it, I'm telling you. This, this is pretty good. Olive oil. Need that. Need that for sure. That was the cheapest one for, for everything. Literally. For everything. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's dessert. Oh, yeah. And these are, these are turnovers, right? Mm hmm. Apple blossoms. Apple blossoms. Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's. The best kind. Fine. Especially with some ice cream or something on and top. And a little bit of caramel. A little bit of caramel. Don't forget about the cocoa almond spread. And the cocoa almond spread. That's good. Actually, the, I've never had this almond. That's good with the raisin bran bagel if you just want to have it by itself with bananas on top of it. Bananas on top. Matter of fact, I might let you try that tomorrow. And this is the most important thing that we bought today. Uh -oh. I feel like people don't drink enough water, you feel me? Yeah. Water is very important. Yeah. You gotta stay hydrated. Talk about the strawberries, <clears throat> the turkey bacon. You got the strawberries, it took, I actually didn't mention the strawberries, but I got the turkey bacon, the, the, the egg white. stuff, I did not, the egg whites. She's trying to stay away from eggs. Yeah, so this is like a transition, I guess. Transition. Talk about the tuna, so the, the, the avocado white in the water. I did not talk about the tuna. That's crazy. I was talking, I was I was supposed to do that because I was mentioning and stuff and you just feeling kind of, you know, something real quick or whatever. I know, but I got to stand back here. I got to grab everything and stand back here. Six, three, six, five. I don't know, motherfuckers. But yeah, but we was talking about water. It's okay to indulge. It's okay to indulge a little bit. Is it? It is. I feel like it's a little overrated. I'm, I'm starting to feel like alcohol is a little overrated. All right, so I'm not gonna say it's overrated. I'm sick of it, and you, I'm not. Well, you sick of it. But I is, but I ain't. You sick of it. I'm not. Because uh, I want to have my own, I want to call it my own uh, whiskey. Whiskey. And unless they do. That's what's going to That's just lifestyle. Is it gonna and be, whiskey. All right, so is it going to be a tequila? Oh, it's going to be a right. It's going to be a whiskey, okay. Yes. I was just about to ask you, see so what's going to be. Whiskey. That'll be good. It is. That's my dog. We can do it. And Wilbur Reserve is very adultish, mm -hmm. by the way. I feel like there's too many people trying to drink that young shit still. Going out to get stuff like that. Casamigos. 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 Casamigos.
Casamigos. Casamigos. Drink the Casamigos. Pour it in my cup. Pour it in my cup. Don't get me wrong. I'm not a tequila drinker. It's cool. Drink shit like Patron and all that stuff. I will drink it, but I like I like the adult shit. You want to talk about being old? I'm 29. I still drink a glass of beer. I don't know about y'all. He's 29. You better be doing that. You're trying to add the time. I don't know where she gets that from, but I like Kavasier. You old? Kavasier. If I'm drinking clear. Bombay Sapphire. She's gonna make some cocktails tonight, so she went and got sweets, lime juice, some official shit. I don't know what other concoctions she's gonna make. My mama did not send me them uh, pictures. Let me call her because she be on my nerves. She thinks she's slick. When your mama ignore your phone call, it's like I just think that's just that's the that's just the ultimate disrespect. I don't think so. She don't love me. Call you, I'm her only child. Call you, to ignore my phone call? She is. She is she it doing what? She know you ain't talking about shit right now. It could be an emergency. I'm about to cry, bro. Brandon, I'm about to cry. How could you? So how could you ignore my phone call? She didn't even let it go to voicemail. She ignored me. Like, I don't got time for you. So she didn't could have let it keep on ringing. I'm about to cry. That's crazy. <gasps> she ain't not busy. It's ten o'clock on a Thursday. She should be at home getting ready for bed, waiting to go to the office tomorrow. Do you love me? Do you do? Do you love me? Love. She don't love me. She don't love me now, and I can tell, L, L. Then I'm an orphan. Oh, 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 she's driving me crazy. Am I even her child? I need a DNA test. You are her child. that both me? You Stressed and depressed and ugly. Even like, when she was. yeah, she looked beautiful, her skin beautiful, and everything. And she probably had a part to play in it. She probably like, y'all not about to make me look like who the fuck did it and why in this motherfucking movie. Not even that. They could have made her look more stressed and depressed, but they didn't. And I like that because you don't have to look like that. She looked beautiful the entire movie. You remember the name? I think it was. This is my first time using these glasses. I hope she don't notice it. A thousand and one. If y'all haven't seen the movie A Thousand and One, y'all should definitely check it out. It's a movie with Tiana Taylor in it, and it's only on Peacock. Hey, check it out. It's a good movie. Tiana looked good. I'm just here for that, and the storyline is good too. It was like very unexpected thing. So, yeah, I'm not gonna tell y'all the movie. I'm just gonna say y'all should go watch it because it's good. I saw a podcast from 19 Keys and he was having like a talk with a conversation with a vegan, this guy. He was basically saying that the maraschino cherries that I like, something about like, um, they are B12 
banned in other countries because of the red dye in it. The amount of red dye in it, or red 40 or something like that. And it's, which is linked to a lot of um, different types of cancers and stuff. And he listed like all the types of cancers. And my heart dropped. I was like, oh. to definitely start um, being cautious of the things that I eat and I want to definitely transition into I want to be a vegan and I think that we could do it especially because you know your girl's a chef so I can cook it up in the kitchen and you wouldn't even know what you're missing out on it's really not hard though, because even when I thought about it, when I went, we went to go eat the other night and I had ordered the lamb chop. What the fuck am I eating this? Well, you thought about it. I didn't think about that shit. Because we never we didn't have a conversation. Can you come try this drink? It might be too strong for you. A shot? Yes, I always do it. I'm at the house. I did it the last time. I was here too. I'm doing it. Titties out. In the corner. Brown. I did not. I didn't even see that. You like the brown nipples. Yes, you do. Yes. Your nipples are brown and pink. <laughs> Seen that shit before. <laughs> no, that just came from I just thought about it. That's crazy. Your nipples like, brown and pink. Nah, nah, don't they brown, motherfucker? They ain't pink. Yeah, yeah right. Hope. You even, seen them before? Even Nala said that. You ain't seen your nipples before? Ah, of course I have. You yeah. just got yourself a shot, huh? Every day. Oh, you want one too? Uh, no, I'm cool. What are you talking about? I'm just saying, it's just common courtesy. Wait, before you take a shot, is it brown or pink? Brown nipples. Brown nipples. Brown nipples. Brown nipples game. Brown nipples game. Yeah, brown nipples game. With <laughs> <laughs> a fuck? brown nipples game. What the fuck? Comment down below, brown or pink. What the fuck are we talking about right now? Comment down below, brown or pink. That's good. Brown over here. This pipe too too strong for you. Oh. I can make it. I can make it a little sweeter for you if you want. Put a little ginger in there if you want. It's too strong probably. Show out. Don't be trying to drink the whole thing. No, damn well it's strong. Man, it's strong, but all right then, chill. You like it does too. Yeah. Is but it... strong for who? Anybody? You hungry right now? No, I was just, I was just gonna ask you how long, you know? Cause you I know certain certain meats and stuff take longer or shorter time. Mm -hmm. Cause like lamb chops mm -hmm. don't take a long time. To Not cook. for me. I can cook in four to five minutes. That's the minimum. Yeah, sure. So it was good. I got to approve it. Brown nipple game. 